What's up, PBL? Welcome to game 27 of the third edition, season three of PBL. We got an exciting matchup. Uh, we got Troy versus Troy here today. Actually, none of the fucking players in the fucking <laughs> We got the Warriors versus the Huskies. The Warriors are number one seed. The Huskies are 17. We got an electric matchup here for you today, folks. So let's get right in, into it. What's up, PBL? You got me today, your play-by-play, -play, Tanner Gothier, joined by my color commentator right here, also Tanner Gothier. I'm gonna be doing it all today by myself because Luke disappeared. Uh, so uh, my I'll predictions. My predictions for this game: we got the Warriors versus the Huskies. I think it's gonna be, I think it's gonna be a great game. I think it's gonna be real close. I think it's gonna be tight to the very end. I think it's gonna be. Uh, punches thrown. I got the Warriors taking this one out, extending their record to six and one after losing to yours truly. I got the Warriors taking this W, 22 to 16. That's what that's my score prediction. Warriors by six, and players are warming up. Let's get right into it. And the Huskies game hasn't even started, and Dom D has a blister. Just Brady is about to lock in because the game's starting. Right. And we're underway. Warriors have the ball after Drew made it for ball first. And Matt with a quick hook on Dummy D. He's going to get the quick 1 nothing start here as Brady's going to update the scoreboard over there. Brady's going to update the scoreboard over there. Brady's not going to update the scoreboard over there. The shot clock reset. Huskies get their first possession of the game. Dom D on the right wing and rims out for Dommy D as the Warriors looking to extend their lead here. They lead one to nothing. Matt, another shot, can't get it to go. It's gonna be Huskies rebound. Dom's gonna get it to Troy quick. Two oh. can't get it to go. And Matt, fast break opportunity here for the Warriors. Clients to take the two-pointer is going to hit the floater. Not going to go. And Huskies have a fresh shot clock to work with here. Dom D is going to drive. Get the layup to go. It's 1-1. <coughs> one one. Brady, scoreboard. 1-1. One, one. All right, 1-1 one one here. Huskies. After the bucket, have the ball. Troy, step back, can't get it to go. Quick rebound for Matt. The Warriors, the number one seeded team in the league with a record of five and one. Matt, full oh, shot, can't cool. get it to go. Little help from Dommy D there. Gets it to roll in for the Warriors. That's gonna be Matt's bucket as he was the closest Warrior to the bucket as when Dom D put it in for him. Dom's gonna poke it, fight for the ball down there on the ramp. It's gonna end up with Matt. He's gonna call ramp with 16 on the shot clock. So Warriors are gonna have 16 here. The score is two to one. A beautiful 75 degrees here at the Spencer Center. Just a perfect day for PBL. Drew outside pump fake. Got Troy jumping. Three. Looking for a shot. Has three seconds. Can't get it to go. Hits off the rim. It's gonna be a fresh shot clock for whoever gets it. It's gonna be the Huskies. It's gonna be a two and it's gonna be good. Bro, someone. Brady's gonna update the scoreboard. Three to two. Yeah, three to two. Yes. It's gonna be three to two here. Right. Huskies lead. Oh my god, I got that. Um, working on Drew here. He's gonna cut it out to the outside. Six on the shot clock. Can't get it to go. Warriors rebound. Matt's gonna check it out to the ramp. Drew's not gonna call ramp yet. Fresh shot clock. <laughs> Working his way back into the game. Can't get the two to go, and it's gonna be Huskies rebound. 
Troy, smart pass. Onto the baseline. Dom D working down low. Gets it to go. Brady, I'll do Hold up. I'll do score. All right, go. It's going to be four to two Huskies here. Right. Troy has the ball. Quick half spin. Gets baseline. Reverse layup gets it to go. <laughs> Beautiful move there from Troy Spencer. Reigning defensive player of the year. Also can do it on the offensive end. Dom looking for a shot. Drew's going to tie him up down low. Dom misses that one. Nothing. Drew front rims it. And the Huskies have a fresh shot clock. Dom D is going to take the screen from Troy. He's going to get that switch on. Matt is going to call ramp. There's going to be... 16. Who's that? Who's that 16? There's gonna be 16 on the shot clock. Troy looking for Dom. He wasn't paying attention. Troy fade away, gets it to go. There's gonna be six to two Huskies here. Dom do quick move to get to the right side, trying to get baseline. Turns back. Ball is up for grabs. The Warriors are going to grab it. And Drew is going to get a download of Matt. Quick hook shot. That's his bread and butter. And it is good. Warriors cut the lead down to three. Here early in this one. Pass unsuccessful for the Warriors there. Good defense by Matt. Just found himself in an unlucky position, and the Huskies get a rather easy basket right there. Matt tried to leave the ball there for Drew. That typically doesn't work out. Troy, a little unconventional shot right there. Can't get it to go. Drew to Matt for two. No good. Troy, quick, out to dog. Fast break opportunity for them. Troy is going to have it on the outside. Looking for his shot, gets it up. Two is gonna be good. <laughs> and just like that, it's a six point lead for these Huskies. Huskies are the 17 seed, but they sure don't play like it. Not too many games under their belt as Troy makes quick work of Matt. Extends the lead to seven, largest of the game. As I was saying, the Huskies are 17 seed. They're not really that big of an underdog playing this number one Warriors team. Drew in the lane gets the dunk. Absolutely electric. Lead down to six for the Huskies. Drew looking for a shot. Troy playing good defense down low. Matt's going to leave it again for Drew. Didn't work last time. Drew couldn't get a shot off this time though. Drew trying to get to Matt down low. Has four on the shot clock. Air balls the floater attempt. And the Huskies going to get to work here. Dom fighting for position down low. Troy sees oh that. Drew just barely rims out there. Dom coming in for the double. Matt, no look at pass to Drew on the ramp. Gets it to go. I had it. I literally had it. Great shot by Drew there. Great er pass from Matt. Dom went in for the double. Matt recognized it. Didn't even have to look for the pass. Drew gets another two wide open. You cannot leave that man open. And just like that, the lead is two. Some defensive blunders here by the Huskies. And just like that, the Warriors are right back in it. I mean, are they ever out of it? No. And the Warriors fighting back here like a true warrior would. Dom's going to get a good poke in. And Matt's going to call ramp with 
I'm gonna wait two seconds. Should be 19 on the shot clock. We got it. I'm not gonna say Drew on right. Troy. Drew, quick floater, couldn't get it to go. Fights for the rebound, but Troy ends up with it. Looking for Dom D. He's gonna go to work in the post. Gets his shot up, and it's good. Folks, look away from the score. Troy, quick one. Trying to get this score off the screen here. We need a quick point. Drew's gonna try to get that done for us, and he gets it. You know, I got positions to work with bouncers right here. So the Huskies have led all game. The Warriors knocking on that door. Drew, no good. I think that's off Troy right there. So after a fight for the rebound, it goes off Troy. No denying it. Fresh 24 here for the Warriors after the out of bounds by Troy. Matt working on Dom. Floater can't get it. Smart play by Matt to tip it out to Drew. He's going to get the shot he likes. Quick two. Got it. The Warriors lead the game for the first time. 12 to 11. Also, I have no idea about The Huskies, who once led by seven, are now trailing in this game against the Warriors. There's no denying that the Warriors have put in the work to get in this position. Drew knew he missed that one. Dom's trying his best to get it out to Troy. Get him his shot. Two's up. No good. Back wedge. That's going to get that rebound. Get it out to Drew. Pulls the two. Oh, my God. The largest lead of the game here for the Warriors is 14 to 11. Drew absolutely catching fire here. Drew said wait, so I just like let Mac back in there. Drew goes wait, and I go like this, and I'm already like getting back into the face. So we're going to redo the possession there after Dom got a little distracted. As I was saying, Drew catching absolute fire. Oh, I blocked that shit too, bro. And after the null possession, Matt goes right back to it and gets it back for his team. They're not letting me get to the punchline, but I was going to call him Katniss Everdeen, but kept getting interrupted. Oh my god, Matt. Couldn't get that layup to go. Troy's gonna get it to Dom. Wanted to pull it. Drew's all in his face. Troy, quick turn. Jump shot, good. Beautiful offense there by the Huskies. Capped off by a Troy jump shot on the left wing. Troy wanted to get it into Dom. Wasn't where he thought he was. Quick possession for the Warriors. Couldn't get it to go. Huskies. Dom on top. It's going to be a two. Air balls. Drew wants it down low with Dom on him. He likes the size advantage he has here. Tells Matthew to back off. Wants it all for himself. Floater good. Front rims rolls in for Drew. Friendly bounce. And the Warriors are going to take their largest lead of the game here at four. 16 to 12. Drew might pull this one. Size not too, probably for the better of the team. Huskies. Troy tried to thread the needle there, but Matt's forearm was all over it. Matt pokes it into the deep end. We're going to have 19 on the shot clock. Dom's going to call ramp immediately. Smart play. And the Huskies are going to have 17 on the shot clock here as they look to come back from their largest deficit of the game. Dombey with the ball spot on top of his head. Gets down low, working on Drew. 
denies the shot, if you want to call it that. Trying his best to get it to Troy. Shots up. Nothing but air. The Warriors. Drew's going to get it. Shot from the corner. You don't see many of those, but he couldn't get it to go. Troy, quick pass into nice. Dom, rolls it in. Good play there from the Huskies. Dom using his size down low. <coughs> Good block there by Drew. Huskies worked out for them. As Dom could quickly get it out to Troy for the two. So the Warriors with a one point lead. Very quick paced game we got going on. Dom is just going to squirt out. They're going to fight for the free ball. Dom's going to have it. Troy, quick shot, front rims. Quick play by the Warriors, but Troy jumps in front, gets it to Dom. Great defense there by Troy after the failed pass. Dom getting absolutely bullied down low by Matt. Troy, quick shot. Another air ball by Troy. You don't see many of those. He's trying to get his shot off quick. He knows Drew and Matt have the size advantage. They can block a lot of these shots. Forced to take these shots quick. Might be why we're seeing them land short. And Drew is going to put it right between the cylinder. Beautiful shot there by Drew. Some could say he has the best looking shot for him in the PBL. Matt goes to the quick floater. And the Huskies are going to have this ball. Troy gets it to Dom. Nice shot, but it just hits both sides of the rim. Finds Matt in the corner. Matt wants it to Drew. Quick lob. Oh, man. Troy, smart pass to get in the corner to Dom so he can clear it. Dom's going to work on Drew down low. Definitely has the weight advantage here. Wants his floater, pump fakes a couple times. Drew blocked again. All right, it's gonna be a fresh. It's gonna be yeah, fresh shot clock. Two blocks there from Drew on that possession, and the Warriors have it with a two-point lead. Drew called ramp as soon as he got it, so it's gonna be a fresh shot clock. Matt. Floater gets it to go. The Warriors just will not go away. Matt and Drew both going to their bread and butter this game. Matt with the hook. Drew with that deep fadeaway too. Drew calls for Matt in the paint. Can't get it to go. Balls going to scamper to the corner and find Troy. Wants to get it to the dome so he can work off the ball. Working on Matt, tries to get it off the window, couldn't quite get it to go, and it's gonna get poked. Not sure what quite happened there, but it's Husky's ball. Dom, quick draw in the corner. Not good. Drew waits, finds Matt, two, got it! Game point for the Warriors. Great back and forth game. Any shot here is going to win it for the Warriors. Matt goes for his shot. Couldn't get it to go. Great offensive rebound. Going to get it out to Drew. Drew working on Troy. Cuts it out to the two point line. It's going to drive in on the right side. Take it back. Drew floater got it. What a game there by the Warriors and the Huskies. What a game. My prediction was 22-16. I was so close. Drew. Heads up, Troy. Yeah. Beautiful game there by the Warriors. You guys are 6-1. and one, Probably the winning winningest team in terms of total wins, how do you feel you and Matt stack up against the rest of the league? Man, I think that performance right there just proves, you know, I feel like me and Matt both would agree. You know, we had good stretches, but a lot of bad stretches too. I don't think we played a complete game at all. 
and we still got away with a good uh, win against a great team. So I think I really, I think I mean I think we're the best team in the league. You know, once we get it going, once we get it, uh, our chemistry a little better, it'll be scary. You know, hopefully the Warriors can be seen in the playoffs this year. Um, yeah. So look out for us to get it going. Definitely a potential to see the Warriors in the finals this season. Matt, great game there for you on the boards, on the defense, played great defense. Got that hook shot. It was going all game. I would disagree with that. I, th I thought I was pretty mad with my performance. I thought, you know, Drew kind of said we didn't really have a complete game. You know, we're a little off still, I think. We beat two good teams, I think, now with a front runner for uh, team of the year. So maybe we got one more game before the playoffs start. I don't know. But I don't know, it just shows, like, even we can play bad and still come out with these wins. So I think we're definitely the top team in the league right now. Definitely a team to beat. Well said by Matthew Bove there. We're going to go to Troy in the pool working on his craft. Troy, a tough game. You played the number one team in the league. You kept it to a six-point game there in the end. Hit some tough shots. How would you describe your performance? At the end of the day, it doesn't matter because uh, we lost the game. Uh, wanted to win that one. I think I probably could have uh, maybe had a few more isolation possessions. Like... You know, I was just kind of run. I was just kind of running around at that at that point, and I think I gassed myself out a little bit at the end there. And then um, I think once they found their rhythm, it was tough to compete. Yeah, so this one hurts. Thank you for your time, Troy. We might see the Huskies back here in the play-in. Dommy D, Dommy D, Dommy D. <coughs> played in a game with some of the best players the PBL has to offer. How do you think you stack up against these players? And do you think that Dami D could be in the finals this year and win that coveted ring? Uh, I mean, uh, I'll be humble here. I don't stack up well. <coughs> they got size. They got shooting. But I play my heart out. That's what matters. It's all that matters. Yep. It's all that really matters. Uh, I mean... I think I'll definitely be in the play in finals is a little bit of a stretch, you know, still recovering from the knee fatigue sets in pretty fast. Uh, but yeah, it's tough. Good game. I feel bad. I let down Troy. Thanks Dom D for your time. Thanks PBL nation for coming out to game 27. We had an electric one against the Warriors and the Huskies. Make sure to hit that like button. Make sure to hit that bell. So, you know, whenever we're posting, you never want to miss an upload. Um, and yeah, we'll be back with some more exciting matchups.